What's going on, y'all? It's Neely from The Pregame Show. And you can look around and tell, I'm not in Boulder, Colorado. I'm back in the MI Crooked Letter. No one does it better. That's what Big Chris said. Let me tell you about this country. Jackson, Mississippi, back home, my hometown. You know, Mother's Day coming up, all that kind of thing. Take a little time off because this is a kind of light period for college football this part of May with graduation going on as we get ready for some downtime before we get back to fall camp. But don't you worry, we still got all kinds of daily exclusive content from the spring session with Coach Prime, his first at Colorado. So you can expect daily drops on the YouTube channel of exclusive content that you hadn't seen. You didn't think we put the spring out all spring, did you? No, we saved some stuff. Just like Coach Prime is saving some scholarships. Everybody wants to talk about the transfer portal and its impact and that it had on the news and the media was sensational. You know, every story you turn to is Coach Prime this, Coach Prime that. What is he doing? Kicking everybody off the team. All kinds of outlandish and extreme statements. But no one is talking about who all he's bringing in. You know, you had some 50 to leave during his time this spring. Some media reports were counting it as high as 70, but they were including walk-ons and going all the way back to before Coach Prime was even hired. The true number, 53 but he's already brought in 42 student athletes to build this program. And when you look at the 53 that has departed, no one is talking about where did they land? Where did they end up going? Even when you looked at the 53 before they departed, nobody wanted to talk about their impact that they had on the 111 team. You know, when you elect a president, they get to shape their new cabinet. So Coach Prime's fingerprints are all over this cabinet from coaching staff to players, and he ain't done yet. Think about this. Coach Prime has a JUCO walk-on tryout coming up at the end of the month. Already 200 plus athletes are registered for that camp. So Coach Prime is keeping some of those scholarships in his pocket because he knows he's gonna find a dog and he knows we still coming. So everybody wanted to panic over the portal and go out there with headlines and clickbaits, but where's that same intensity? Boy, seeing how you guys go rewrite, reprint, reprint, we run all these things. And you run it with the same intensity that you ran this other stuff? Can you run it with the same intensity? I want to see if it's possible. I want to see if it's possible. This portal, man, you can't have it both ways. The door opens, it swings both ways. People come, people go. But all you want to talk about is the people that have gone. Well, let's look at the people that have gone. Where did they end up? Where have they signed? Let's look at their impact they had while they were with the team. How many plays did they make? What was their impact on the 111 team? Now look at the guys that he's attracted to come to the program and what they produce where they're coming from. More are coming because they want to be down and play for Coach Prime because they understand the spotlight that is on this program and where we're going. And we're not waiting for a couple of years from now. We're here to win now. As Coach Prime says, we coming.